the information from Okada-san. Very valuable. I also learned something through my own efforts. We must meet. Where'll it be this time? Trash processing plant? Deserted in-cart station? In the south of Japan town, there is a street market. It is on the footbridge above the main street. Use the elevators. It is easy to get lost. I am on my way there. Do not make me wait. Hey, Judy. How you feeling? Shitty, but something came to me. So what did you come up with? The mock dive, Lizzie's bar, used to be a joy house. Tiger Claws killed one girl too many, so people took matters into their own hands. Belongs to us now. Clouds could stand to get the same makeover. Got the mocks to agree to take over Clouds? No, I'm trying to get you. Know someone at Clouds will take our side. Will you help? Fine. Got me on board. Oh, yes. Okay, so what's the plan? First up, we gotta talk to Michael Maeda. If she's not with us, might as well throw our hands up in the air. Sure Maiko's gonna want to join forces? If I was sure, I'd be on the hollow to her and we wouldn't be having this conversation. Let me rephrase. Any chance she'll slap us around and then shove us out her mega tower window? Of course, sure. Guess I can work with that? When are we doing this? Early morning. Clouds will be closed. Hardly a soul lurking at that time. How early? Before eight. I'll be by the entrance. No, scratch that. The balcony above clouds. We'll sneak in. No one needs to know we're there. On the balcony. Got it.
there she is. What now? Shit. Oh, back up. What? I should kill the crew? I don't know. Did she anything? Hey, Rogue. Got the scratch. Got the cred for the Hellman job. Fine. Anders Hellman, flip me the deeds. Two, please. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often. Determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while, either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. Thanks, but I'll pass. Hell's wrong with you? Good stuff. Your loss. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Let's see what you got. Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Probably keeping him hidden from Arasaka. Must have worked on a top secret project. Mm-hmm. Hidden from Arasaka or any other megacorp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table, but catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm hmm No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look. Their backup hustle will be on us. But... Right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. Dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Nab and Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Wise Pan Am gotta help me. I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, it wasn't a good day for her. She ran into a hitch. Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her, but if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. Fine, let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels too. Naturally, you'll call her first. Sending you her deeds. 
Oh, finally. Let's I'll get clear. out of here. Thanks. Good luck. Listen, don't laugh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town. Like, murals or something. But no, they're not real. Uh, just a Kiroshi blip. Could take a look. No. No, images are too complex for a blip. It's like they're... symbols. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle the data overload. Either that, or it's reached the cortex. Can you do anything? Nope. Better find a way to get rid of that chip. I saw a weird image out on the street. Seems like your line of work. What'd it look like? Grabbed a scan, take a look. Tarot. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. Be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right, great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road. 
So go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Oh, finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. Dunno. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. Their bodies, okay. they never age! But notice now. their eyes, cold and dead! Oh yeah?
not fucking touch me. I do not understand. Does Arasaka not have enough of its own people? Look around, sir. He didn't are... but... Oh, perfect timing. Why? What are we doing here? You shall learn soon. I acquired some information of my own. Do you know who most wish to honor Arasaka-sama with the parade? He's a murderer. The irony makes me sick. Still don't see how this gets us anywhere. Wanna make it to the top? I have had an idea. Look to the sky. The dash floats will pass precisely this way. If I could just get onto Hanako-sama's float, I could speak with her in private. Get there how? Why jump? Of course. And how you aim to manage that? While you are occupied with your shady dealings, I learned more about the floats. They are all kept in one place, Arasaka Industrial Park. It is there that they prepare them. We need only to break into the compound, find the right float and inject a virus into its system. You will then be able to disable any security before I sneak inside. Right? Then what? I have an infected shard. It was not cheap, but the man who sold it to me guaranteed it will work. Let us move on. Hey, 
To take control of the float is one thing, but not all. The security concerns me, the snipers especially. I will be an easy target. But I may have an answer. Okada-san mentioned the city cameras. If we gain access to them, we will see exactly where the snipers are. You can deal with them as I advance. Sounds like a plan. You agree just like that? The risks are considerable. Yeah, well, get more and more used to that. And now, what would you say to a small test? We must try the shard. The camera control room is in front of us. You must get inside and infect the network. That is all. Uh-huh. And in the meantime, you'll do what? Crack open a can of suds? I will not touch alcohol. At work. I will watch your back. Now, get to it. B? There's no time to waste, V. Milanoidia.
fucking worked. And? Done. System's ours. The shard works. Good. The easy work we have done. To break into Arasaka Industrial Park will not be such a bed of roses. But before we discuss that... Sit. I have not eaten since yesterday. Give me the best on the menu. I highly recommend the uh, yakitori today. Anything that isn't local, please. See you tomorrow. Can't believe I'm saying this, but this Sokka scum might actually prove useful. He's a well-trained dog, needs orders, that's all. And when he outlives his purpose, we'll flatline him. Bridge we might cross, but only might. We'll see. Glad we're on the same page. You never know what a dog's thinking. Might be the same thing. What is this? Hey, Yakitori. Okay, I have laid the plan. One. We break into Arasaka Industrial Park. One and a half. We hack Hanako-sama's fault. Two, during the parade, with my help, you eliminate any snipers. Three, I get onto the float. Four, I convince Hanako-sama of the truth. Well, sounds like a suicide run, but done dumber shit than this, so. Things even more stupid than stealing from Arasaka. None dumber yet, no. Set the bar pretty high with that one. Now, we part. Reconnaissance is required. You're a stranger in a strange land. Going with you. Hmm, true. And you with your hands, skills, mind of a thief. Agreed. This we will do together. Louder! Louder! I have decided to double the amount of our Flash. active Night City security forces. President Myers has he eliminated the vast obstacle between himself and the complete power. The and they surrendered it to him. Tell me that. What do we call the murder of my father? Was that not a provocation? Was that a not a... Arasaka. An empire built to last. Before Yorinobu set fire to it from the inside, all of this began with him. The factions, power struggles, all of this. Ksa! Well, why did Saburo tolerate it all? Can't get my head around it. Could have kept his son on a short leash. Arasaka sama was a strong and disciplined man, the strongest man I have ever known. And yet, at a critical moment, he showed a weakness. For Yorinobu. For his daughter. When Yorinobu formed his band of hounds, declared war on his own family, Arasaka-sama could have crushed him with one word. Yet he did not. For he did not wish his daughter to suffer. When Yorinobu returned, his tail between his legs, she persuaded her father to give him a second chance. Do you understand? Hanako-sama saved Yorinobu from the consequences of his deeds. Feels like that's about to change. As long as we get Hanako to believe our version of events. Conscience could also come into play, assuming she's got one. We must reach her first. Will you join me? Sure, why not? 
Let us go from here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please come again. So dust and plastic. I have found a good place to observe. We must just climb up here. <laughs> now, this way. Fortune smiles to us. It seems no one is here today. I would call this a beautiful view of the city, if... If? If there was anything to admire. Hate Night City that much? Hmm. Perhaps I'm simply homesick, as you say. Now, you must look for vulnerabilities, weaknesses, while I try to think of a diversion. Arasaka cannot discover our intentions. A bit of sabotage is just what we need to divert their attention. You will have the best view on the left. I will try here. This old scope should be good for something. Shall we begin? Let's do this. Security hub's liable to be in that building. system. A lot of guards. I could use comms for a diversion. Pipes. See them? We could use them to get inside. Flush turrets by the gate. The last resort. I'd 
do not wish to die, dear. Looks like a service tunnel by the road there. It could lead to the warehouses. Think I've seen everything. We have what we came for. So, we going in? Hmm. Is this what you said before entering Kampiki Plaza? I wish to be certain. We have not overlooked anything. We should wait and observe. If nothing out of the ordinary happens, then yes, we go in it. Sounds sensible. Better get comfy. Looking feline. Thought they'd all disappeared from the city. It is the first animal I see in Night City, except cockroaches, of course. First it was birds, then dogs. Cats actually put up a fight longest. Perhaps it is a bacchanal. Chill. It's just a cat. Perhaps. Perhaps not. My grandmother knew many, many stories about Kitsune, Kappa, Bakeneko too. Miss Home? A foolish question. I am from the slums of Chiba 11. Once when I was desperate to leave there, I... Ah. <sighs> Bad memories washed away by time. I long only for the simple days of childhood. What was it like growing up in Chiba 11? I remember the chemical stench of the canal, where we boys washed our shirts. Corporate transporters sometimes passed through our slab. Arasaka selecting children but only the clean ones. What'd they need kids for? To be corporate soldiers. When they chose me, I felt I had won the lottery. 
In the army, I was given everything I lacked before. Discipline, regular meals, and when I proved I was gifted, an education. And all you had to do in return was kill Saburo's enemies. I sense that you judge me, and yet you have no right to. Unlike you and your friend, Mr. Wells, I was not arrogant. I did not take the easy path. Slimming away for a quirk. Not exactly everybody's dream. Oh, yes. Because thieving is so much more honorable. At least I'm not fleecing this planet and its people in the name of profit margins. Corporations need capital and resources to keep all in order. Who else is to rule? Corrupt governments? The masses? Attached to feeders? Cynics? Nihilists? Like you? Come on, not everybody wants to change the world. Suddenly, this is true. Tired of bickering. Let's just drop it. Sometimes I wish to become a nomad. To leave this world. Forget everything. Never too late to change. What is your expression? One cannot teach an old dog new tricks. Do you know what I think? What's that? That day in Kompiki, we both have lost someone important. And we are not at peace with this. So we seek conflict, argue eagerly. Don't be smart, got no idea what I feel. It is the duty of the living to atone for the dead. Hanako-sama shall aid us in our mission. Or she'll make sure we die for good. Bakaneko got sick of us, looks like. It will find its own way. As will we. I think it is time to do something, hmm? oh, Getting worse. You do not look so bad. I'll be in touch. The diversionary action, that is mine to do. <laughs> <laughs> 